Hello everyone, Jorge Huertas once again with all of you. Today I'm going to show you what is and how to use blockchain. This video is also available in Spanish. Well, blockchain is a structure of data. The characteristics are the blockchain is a single register, agreed and distributed in several nodes of a network. It is a public and distributed database in which all transactions are made and recorded. It works through a network of computer link. It does not require any central authority or third parties acting as intermediaries. It works as a book for registration of purchase, sale operations, or any other transaction. It is technological basis of how Bitcoin work or any other cryptocurrencies. It is a very inter interesting alternative to receive income from the sale of product or services developed with an, any agile methodology. Okay, so blockchain or blockchain, it depends on how you want to spell it, got different components. It's very important that you understand each component to know how it works. The first thing is the block. The block is a package of recorded information in a transaction. It's the link of the chain because the chain is made of block. So each block is a transaction. A node. A node is any computer that can connect to the ne network of the blockchain. Confirmation. The confirmation is when a transaction has been verified by the net. Ledger. It is where they register every operation that performed by users. Distribution. A ledger distribution it is the base type of the expanding data through many computers. Transaction. When the information is sent from one address to another. Proof of work. It is the uh, consensus algorithms used to confirm transactions and produce new blocks in the chain. Miner. The miner is the computer that does the calculations in, involved in each transaction. Reward. The miner who mine transaction is rewarded with coins. Blockchain. It is the whole system. It is the digital book share where the transactions are recorded permanently. So these are the main components of the blockchain. Now we are going to see example. So when you want to send a document or make a transaction with Bitcoin or any other currency, it's very important that you understand that the transaction is information are represent online as a block. The block is sent to each of the members of the network computing. After that, the network approves and verifies the transaction. The block is added to the chain, an alternative, and the, for the transparency of everything. It's very important to understand something. A blockchain is not made in an average um, explorer, you know, like uh, Explorer or Firefox. This is dark web. So, a lot of people have lose money here because they think that there is only one blockchain and you just have to make a transaction. I strongly recommend before you do this to find someone that has done it before and it has been working okay because a lot of people think that this is easy. If this is not going well, you cannot call to a bank or say, hey, People store money from my blockchain. It doesn't work that way. So it's very important that before you make the transaction, please find support with someone that has already done it and that can guide you in the process. Because here there are millions of different blockchains. So it's very important that you understand that if this transaction is not going well, you're going to lose money and there is a strong possibility that you can never get it back. You don't have anyone to call and say like, hey, could you please 
give me my money back. It, it doesn't work that way. When the transaction is complete, you will find and verify the transaction. If you are creating or already have a um, blockchain or, or you already have a product or service, this is an interesting way to make new income. So if people can pay with Bitcoin or any other cryptocurrency, it's good for you. It can be an alternative very interesting to receive income in your business. Before you put money in a blockchain, get references and be very careful. Here, it's very important and I recommend that before you put money in a blockchain, find someone that support you and make you understand how it works. Because if you are new at this, you don't have any experience, a lot of people has been losing money here and you don't have anyone to complain and make a, a reclaimance of this. Thank you so much. I hope this video will be a big help in your development and in your knowledge. Please follow us on social media, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. Thank you to all of you. We are the number one design thinking channel and agile methodology channel. Remember, every Monday we have a new video in Spanish, every Thursday a new video in English. Thank you so much. I will see you next time.